It's a very quick explanation of uh, what's going on with fooling the MCM to force a lower system voltage even though the battery voltage is higher. Got a breadboard as you can see in position and the BCM interceptor sitting on top of the MCM. And basically what's happening is uh, I've got a pot here which is being fed into the BCM interceptor uh, resistor potential divider network and that's adjusted to provide 140 volts to the BCM and the MCM. Uh, I found that this input is important on the MCM and this voltage has to match with the others as well. So you can't just fake the BCM output voltage using the interceptor. So what I need now is I need 140 volt, a low current supply to feed the BCM and the MCM continuously. And then we move on to the uh, little relay I've got set up there and that's taking the V pin voltage and initially when the car's first turned on it's allowing the V-pin voltage to rise gradually as it does normally charging from the uh, normal system and uh, when the main contactor relay activates it also then activates this little tiny relay here which switches over the V-pin voltage to another potential divider which is set at 140 volts to match the voltage that was being supplied to the MCM and the BCM. That appears to work. Uh, at the moment we've got no IMA errors and uh, I need to now find 140 volt supply just to uh, keep this side constant because as the batteries go down then the difference will be detected and it will give an error so at the moment it looks like I can force 140 volts or whatever voltage we want but I need now to get a low current 140 volt supply to supply the MCM and the BCM so it looks like this mod's probably only going to be uh, practicable on uh, lithium type vehicles I'll keep you updated so we still see we're going ahead quite reasonably